Greetings, this is Anthony Anaslan. I just want to share something with you if you're a Christian. But if you are not a Christian, this is also for you. Okay? I want to read it from the script here. It is taken from the book of Peter. That's 1 Peter chapter 2. And I would read from verse 20, 21 onwards. For even hereunto were you called, because Christ also suffered for us, leaving us an example that ye should follow his steps. Who did no sin, neither was guile found in his mouth. Who, when he was reviled, reviled not again. When he suffered, he threatened not, but committed himself to him that judges righteously. Who his own self bear our sins in his own body on the tree that we that's we being dead to sins should live unto righteousness by whose stripes you were healed you know and I just want to zero in on by his stripes you were healed you know, in the book of Proverbs, chapter 4, reading verse 20 to 22, it says these words. Um, my son, attend unto my words, give air unto my saying. Let them not depart from thine eyes, keep them in the midst of thine heart, for they are life unto those that find them, and medicine or health to all their flesh. Now you have to find it for, for it to be life to you. And it's also medicine to your flesh. And I was speaking to a guy today, a friend today. You know, he, he has like, as he said, arthritis in, in, his, in his hip or so, so forth. And um, he has been taking these, these tablets. He's taking medication for, you know, so that he can, it can ease the pain. You know, but the thing about it is, the word says in that same book of Proverbs, chapter 4, verse 20, 22, that... If you find his words, they are life unto you, and they are health or medicine to all your flesh. So his word, when you find it, works like medicine for you. Now, I don't know what situation you are in, whether it's for, for health, whether it's for wealth, or relationship, or whatever the situation. The word will work for you if you can believe it, and if you can use it as medicine, because it will work as medicine if you can find it, if you can receive it, if you can believe it, it will work as medicine for you, okay? But the scripture what I was zero, um, speaking about today is concerning First Peter chapter 2 and reading verse 24, by whose stripes you were healed. I want you to know, friend, that you were healed. You were healed. You were. Jesus took that sickness as your sickness upon the cross. He took it upon that tree. He took it. He took it. I want you to understand that. If he took it, you cannot have it. You cannot be carrying it around. He took it from you. So I want you to, to just believe the word of God. Believe what Jesus did. And I believe as you continue to believe, that word will make you free. He took your sickness. He took your diseases. He took it upon the cross. And by his stripes, you were healed. You were. You were healed. Just know that you were healed. Not you shall be healed. You were healed. That is, it, it, it has passed. So I want you to just receive your healing in the name of Jesus. Receive your healing in the name of Jesus. And I wish you great health in Jesus' name. God bless you.